So welcome, we're in the Plymouth dry land room. Right over there we have the dry board, which uh, you can do flips and twists. You can do tricks that you wouldn't normally be able to do. You can do it into there. You have harnesses, which uh, coaches will pull athletes up, protect them, keep them safe. We've got some of our athletes being treated by our physios, our soft tissue therapists. Our bodies go through a lot, so it's important that these guys get us ready for our competitions that we're going to be doing soon. We also have the trampolines. You can practice your somersaults on the trampolines in a very fast way, as Jack is demonstrating for us. It's a good place to practice your spatial awareness so that when you go into the diving pool, you're ready to do all of your dives. We spend, I would say, 80% of our time in the dry land room, and um, it's fun. Finished in the gym and about to get in the pool and train some 10 meter dives. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. I always enjoy coming down to Plymouth and seeing everyone and hopefully all the competitions go well. Two years ago, uh, I was 15 and I won nationals down here, so hopefully it can go the same way this year. I love nervous faces, but everyone gets on really well and wishes everyone best of luck. Usually, you know, you come up with a chamois. It's like a little towel which you dry yourself with. You make your way upstairs using that. You're usually a bit out of breath, so you want to have a bit of time to just sort of relax. You know, you don't want to be thinking too much when you're on the board because if you overthink things, stuff's going to go wrong. And you know, when you're falling from you know this height and the impact that you fall at, you can hurt yourself. And then usually you want to do some dry run throughs, which uh, it's an imitation of the dive, and you go through it mentally in your head as well. And then uh, yeah, then you just uh, let it go. I mean, you instantly know if you hit the water if it's a good or a bad dive. And then, uh, yeah, it's just a matter of waiting for the scores. The facilities are here are, are brilliant. Um, it's one of uh, the pools that's regularly used for the Nationals. The crowd's always great in Plymouth. It's usually packed out and it's usually a successful weekend.